that's even harder, I guess, than most influential. <laughs> but uh, I just chose one that has an interesting history for us and was influential on uh, what we've done uh, over the years in terms of design. And uh, watching words move, th uh, this was published by Chronicle Books in 2006. And it's still in print, but what it is actually is a reproduction of something we did in 1959. Uh, and at that time, we took uh, proofs of type and cut them up to do this. And, this. and then in 1962, I think, Typographica, which is a great English magazine at the time, did a little reprint of it uh, for publishing, it, but as an insert, it was only about four inches square in, in one of the issues of the magazine. And the whole book is about taking one size of type, one color, I mean, this one is exactly the opposite of the other book. This is one color, black, uh, very small book, uh, and, but doing things with the type to make it expressive. And, and that's become very much a part of our approach to design, so that's why, uh, you know, I say it's a favorite, uh, favorite book, because what it, what it signifies is, uh, is that. And I, I sort of feel silly bringing books 